and what we are going to look at the artwork that that five characters what I'm calling the Nkrombe series I created uh, last year after I finished my doctoral process it evolved into what you're seeing and what I'm going to tell you is it's an in-between of forms I'm calling it the non forms because they exist between two forms they're inspired by the Maasai who is what is my heritage is the Ethiopian side of me and the Meru readers, which is, I went into depth, of course, because that's the language I speak. But the forms you are looking at are in between. That means they are unstable. That's why they look like they are shaping themselves. And when you look at them, they're in motion. The essence of these artworks is actually the essence of myself as well. But more so, if you look at them, you will feel your own essence if you can focus, because they need to bring down all the noise around you and feel the artworks. They are not normal artworks like you see, you know, figurative faces, portraiture, portraiture. That's not what I'm talking about here. I'm going deeper into who we are as Africans. The experience has been good. Very educative, mind-opening. I have gained so much information from the exhibition. And um, it has caused me to think a lot about um, where we come from, like our roots, and how it influences who we are uh, up until this point. Fine art can be a very professional career, a very respectable uh, pursuit. In fact, if you come to the Tafari Castle and set up for the arts right now, our studios are very stellar. They're very clean, inspired by Anne. So we have had so much to learn uh, from, from her work and how she's been doing it. And one of the jokes that goes around uh, Tafari is that and in as far as her art is concerned, she uses colors that are edible, that looks, you know, edible. But when I saw this, I also felt very inadequate because it's very, very complex. What did you eat last night? This and that. And that, that of a game. The game? The game of cocktails. The cocktails of what? The cocktails of cockroaches. And the cockroaches? the cockroaches of the hills. More drawn to the 3D pieces, the centerpiece installation, which is a poem, a childhood poem by Anne. And I love the way that she has used um, different materials to weave. And to me that represents sort of different generations, the colors, the paper, and the yarn.